up buddy nerdigans this is the one and only packer girl 89 and today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for shangri-la frontier chapter 65 so before i get into this recap and live reaction let me just remind you to hit that like share and subscribe buttons also because of course this channel let alone this video are not sponsored and i'm just on a high speed struggle train heading into chaos and it's getting faster by the second if you love what i'm doing i'm going to help keep this channel alive and a kickin feel free to hit up my cash up and paypal those links are in the description box below so it was going so well negotiations were going smoothly but uh oh yeah kitty it was going smoothly until these uh till this motherfucker asked about lagonia right keys right Sal? yeah anyways let's get to this chapter see what's in store for us this week, and this chapter is titled, Know Whose Hand You Dance Upon. Now, you're gonna tell me all about Lagonia, all right, Senraku? And Amelia, I should have known she'd do this, and I'm sure she wants info on Lagonia-related unique scenarios, and what I need the most is a free pass to the Land of Rabbits. Huh? A free pass? Yes, it's well known that uh, you can use, your, uh, use the tour of Lagonia unique scenario to go there, but once you beat the Lagonia Viper boss attacking the land, uh, quit freeloading, get out of here, go away, go away. You're forced out of Lagonia right, right then and there, and you're never allowed to come back. But look at you, Senraku, you, not only did you bring a talking Vorpal bunny out of that land, you're supposed, you're supposedly going in and out of Lagonia all the time. So, how did you, how do you do it? I've got to know. And, um, and SF Zoo will offer you anything we can in return. Oh, here I was thinking that she'd ask me how to unlock the unique scenario that lets you befriend Emil. Oh, maybe I can make something out of uh, this after all? No! Don't do it! Remember what was said. You can start a war like this. You do not want to start a war, because then Bunny's not going to like this. Well, I did it via invitation to Lagonia, and I ain't telling her about that quest. Um, well, it'd be quicker to ask Emil that, so if you don't mind giving her back real quick... Mm, well, if I have to, hey man, come come back for me. <laughs> no dice, huh? She's limp too. She's not having the. She's just done. She's gone. Yeah, kitty. She's she's gone. Speaking of little fuss budgets, hey fussies. This one here loves to meow, doesn't he? Kitty, do you want to start a war? Do you want to start a war, kitty? It's like, no, I don't want no part of this. Sure, just chill, kitty, here. Play with your toy. Here's your toy. Just play. There we go, now he is so kitties. Yeah. No dice, huh? She's limp. All the special Lagonian parfaits you want on my tab. Ah, special Lagonian parfaits? Yeah, kitty, if you're good, I'll give you tweets. Oh, look at that face as soon as I said tweets. Yeah. See, look at that. Where, um, and there you're, where, and there are your treats in Rocco? Oh, okay, she's back. Oh, huh? Wait, what was I doing? So cute. All I remember is that you'll buy me some uh, special Agonia parfaits, uh, along with the spell book I've had my eye on for a while. Don't pat it. But, Emil, I have a question to ask. What is it? It's about Lagonia. You sometimes invite players uh, in it to beat beat up snakes for you, right? So it's not that humans are banned entirely uh, entirely from there. Mm, I don't think so, no. So after everyone else leaves, how can they get back to Lagonia? Mm, that's kind of a government issue. I don't have an answer for that. See, you'll be starting wars. You'll be starting wars, right, Keys? Starting wars. But my, my um, but my big brother, um, Ivor can help. He's a real brainy, creative kind of guy. If you're asking Sunraku, I bet he'd lend a hand. Great, another new rabbit. Oh, great, another new rabbit. He's my oldest brother, and his job is, and his job is King of Lagonia. King? Wait, so Old Fash wasn't their leader? Guess he retired and left the throne to his son. Um, could we ask him now, maybe? Of course, of course. I'll hop right o um on over and go um go in depth about this with him. Uh, Emma, wait! Emma, wait! Don't bitch! Do you want Emma to get you info or what? She looked like she was fleeing us. 
I just wanted one last pet. Bullshit, you just want one last pet. You just want to go like this and hug and squeeze her. You're full of shit. Full of shit. Unlike you. I like it. Kitty. Kitty loves to, loves to be hugged and squeezed and loved. He loves kisses. He loves his belly wobs. Like, Kitty, you love your belly wobs. Look at that. Look at that face. He loves his belly wobs. He loves it. Okay, so until she returns, we could save this topic for later? I guess we have to. Well, so be it. I'll pay this price. You got it. We now have a deal. Dude, I hope they, I hope that Emil's like, uh, Emil comes back and says, no, no, can't do. This bitch can't come. Here you go. Uh, one Tomb of Truth, a uh, Tomb Guard edition. Yes, I must read it at once. How much did you fleece him for? <laughs> one hundred million, Monty. Hmm. That's nasty. It's not just 20% of my debt. Okay, but well that's squaring away. I have something to offer to, um, offer too. It's for, uh, Schwazer Wolf, the library, SF Zoo, and us and the Wolf King. I'd like all of us to form a clan alliance. I got a bad feeling about this. Ah, I see. That was her aim from the start? It's fine by me, but it's still SF Zoo's turn to talk. I have no reason to refuse either. I doubt it'll, it'll change our activities much. Dude, library is probably stoked. All right, Pencil Gone. I'll play along with this. Nope, no problem here. I don't want to uh, invite you even. Let's forge an alliance pack then. I got a horrible feeling about this. <sighs> it's finally over. Um, why are you acting like you work so hard? All you did was just sit there. Yeah, Kaz. Yeah, Kaz. I'm not talking about you, Kat. I'm talking about Kaz. But you worked really hard today, didn't you? You love knocking over shit, don't you, cat? But you love your belly wobs, don't you, cat? Yeah, you love your belly wobs, belly wobs, for the cat. Your kitty, go play with your ball. He loves the ball. Um, it took a lot of work to catch you, you know. Did you know uh, they, that they call you Bigfoot? <laughs> did, they, did you know that they call you Bigfoot online? <laughs> What's that giving me stupid nicknames? But still, Sinraka, didn't you give up that info too easily? Oh, you mean the deal with Lycon and um, undoing the marking? Uh, it was just her battle patterns. I'd give that away for free. Well, you shouldn't. If you don't mind me speaking as a pro gamer, uh, we're not in the 2D modder era anymore. Um, in full dive games, knowing your opponent's moves uh, takes on way more meaning than you think. Especially with a unique monster, they're not like bosses, the kind uh, every player sees. That info's priceless. We're not talking about status ailments and other stuff. You can work your uh, work your own way through. Yeah, maybe you're right. Yeah, maybe Schwazer Wolf kind of had an insight on us like that. The library won't be a problem to deal with. Yes! But SF Zoo, those guys are locusts. They uh, treat NPCs and monsters as the same thing. If they get a permanent visa into Lagonia, who knows what will happen. It's a, it'd be a mad spree of petting. Dude, they'd be starting wars up in there. I know you're hiding some kind of unique scenario, but I won't pry you for it. Just don't do something stupid and, and let, um, let it fall into anyone else's hands, okay? That's my intention. But, uh, well, I accomplished my original goal, so I'm good for now. You mean the clan, clan alliance? Yes, now I can use the access and equipment retained by the other alliance members. I didn't expect every one of them to say yes. To them, I'm sure it's like, give us some info and we'll help, you, we'll help out a little. But we won't give up that, e give up that easy. Uh, right now, we're holding five ace cards. One being the first group to beat an X unique um, scenario. Uh, we have information on Bob Moot. Uh, two, we got access to Inventoria and the assorted legacy weapons in there. Three, we have de facto exclusive access to the ancient craftsman job, one that's possessed only by Varax so far. And four, Yus and Raku have a lot of intel on getting into Lagonia, um, along with the existence of uh, cat, cat and stuff. And five, we have an inside line on access, accessing the next X unique scenario. Ooh! Simply hinting that we carry those cards gives us power. Be quiet, cat. Information can control and kill people. We're a new clan, only three people, but we got diehard game-leading clans serving us, and, we, and we'll stay one step ahead. Yeah. Don't you think that's the, about the funniest thing ever? I don't know how funny. That's fucking amazing, though. Nice sneer on your face there, Pencil God. I resorted to this stick to, um, 
too quickly in United Rounds. Gotta use the carrot more uh, this game. We're being, we're so, we're so gonna be villains, aren't we? All hunted down by the masses? If we are, I'll see y'all uh, out in Fleet of Lagonia. <laughs> yeah. That can is tweets. Jesus Christ. Couldn't wait another minute. Ah. <sighs> Okay, let's split up for now. Let me know if anything happens, and don't ignore invites next time. Yeah, yeah, just go. But Emma isn't back yet, is she? And I'll go to Lagonia. I want to see how Varak's doing. But to do that, I'll need to die and get warped back. All right, if I'll fight them again, then I'll farm their drops like mad before I reach Lagonia. I'm so going to score a stinger next time. Ooh, real-time update applied. Fixed behavior... Oh, no! Fixed behavior patterns in some monsters. Uh-oh. But... But Emil isn't back yet, huh? I'm telling you. Big Bro is, is gonna be like, hell no. Emil's probably t telling him about how fucking crazy those bitches are. And be like, look. Sunraku is cool. Keep Simraku, Simraku can come and go as he pleases, but not these fucking crazy motherfuckers. Nah, they, they gotta stay out. But this right here. This right here, though. Hmm. Oh, and Simraku is uh, at level 78 now. Sweet. But that real-time update. This will be very interesting. But I'm curious what you guys think. Obviously, they won in this, but what's gonna happen with with those fuckers? They are scary. Oh god. Oh god. Oh my god. SF Zoo is scary. They're not gonna be allowed in Lagonia. No fucking way they are going to be allowed in Lagonia. No way. Anyways, I wonder if what they're going to do is they're going to say only Sunraku is allowed and, and only him and not let any of the alliances up in there, let, let alone his allies. Oh my god. Because remember I was saying that it's possible that um, Sunraku's allies could go in Lagonia? But now that they're in a clan, that would mean SF Zoo could go there. So I, I gotta wonder if it's only gonna be limited to Sunraku himself going. Very curious what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdic and Zinc. If you love what I'm doing, want to help keep this channel alive and kick it so I can keep bringing you more Shangri La Frontier content, a few ways you could do that. Donate to my Cash App, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.